so awesome, man. Ladies and gentlemen, if you could please find your seats, the presentation will begin shortly. Gentlemen, please welcome to the stage Autodesk's senior manager for reality capture, Aaron Morris. Welcome, everyone. Uh, we excited to hear what this is all about? Yeah. Great to hear. All right, so we're living in an era of amazing technological progress. Sensing and scanning devices, or smart devices, are ubiquitous and cloud-connected. They project by the year 2020, 50 billion devices will be online. With this comes digitization of our world, comes uh, virtualization, and increased automation, which is dramatically changing where and how we live. And speaking about where and how we live, trends like population increase, Whoa. <laughs> and the mass migration of people into urban environments is uh, really taking a toll on our stock of buildings. It's estimated over the next five years, 182 billion square meters of additional space will be required to fill these demands. This, in turn, is driving construction, and what it's really doing is exposing the problems and inefficiencies with an outdated ways of building buildings. The culmination of all of these things together really defines the evolution of the AEC industry. The lines are being blurred between design and construction. Information from the field, that being the construction site, is being brought to the office faster and faster. And that is allowing, when measured against the design intent, to identify problems before they become real problems. The net result is the opportunity to save trillions annually on unnecessary project cost. All right, I got to admit, I'm a little bit biased here, um, but I think at the heart of all this is reality capture. And myself and the wonderful team at Autodesk 
have been trying to democratize the access and use of reality data uh, for quite a while. And to that end, uh, Autodesk, in collaboration with Leica Geosystems, have come together to shape the future of reality capture. Now, to explain exactly what that means, I would like to introduce Leica Geosystems Chief Technology Officer Burkhart Beckham to the stage. Thank you, Aaron, for the introduction. For more than 100 years, we have been building the finest and most revolutionary measurement instruments. And today is the day we've been looking forward to for quite some time. Today, we are introducing the new Leica BLK360. Together with Autodesk, we have taken everything we learned about reality capture and we created the BLK360. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's black. It's a special kind of scanner. <laughs> 360,000 3D points per second, up to 60 meter range and millimeter precision. But wait, it's much more than a scanner. It's the first true imaging scanner. It's a 360 degree panoramic imaging device. 15.1 megapixel, three camera system, full HDR, LED flash support, calibrated, parallax free, 150 megapixel image. And it's super fast. It will take less than three minutes to reality capture a room like this. On top, we have given it a full panoramic long wave infrared camera, a built-in thermal camera to reality capture beyond the visitor. But I see on screen, it's larger than life. That's why I want to show you the real thing. Thank you so much. This is it. It's very small. I think we can proudly say it's the world's smallest. And it's lightweight. It's the lightest of its kind. Fully loaded, only 2.2 .2 pounds. And it's made from aluminum. It really has a nice feel to it. And it's designed for indoors. And it's designed for outdoors. <laughs> it's light, it's portable, it's battery powered with a single battery capacity for more than 50 reality captures. You see no cables? There are no cables. It's truly wireless. Connecting via Wi-Fi to the iPad Pro, controlling it within Recap360 Mobile. See this thing? There's only one button. <laughs> <laughs> Making reality capture truly simple. So slick, easy, and simplified. We can say it's the Leica BLK360 it's our contribution to reality capture for everyone.
So, uh, so Burkhardt gave it away. Uh, it's OK, because that's uh, really only half of the solution. Um, as he mentioned, the, uh, we're developing the iPad uh, on the iPad Pro, Recap 360 Mobile, uh, because for the full user experience, we're hoping to see reality capture be easy, reliable, and collaborative. Um, developed specifically for the iPad Pro, it'll be available in the App Store when the device comes out. Um, you can review your online projects, you can take measurements, you can make notes, you can interact with the data, and it syncs with the cloud. It caches from the cloud. So wherever you are and wherever you, your stakeholders are be, you can be connected. Now specifically, there we go. Specifically for the BLK360, um, what we've done is create an interface. So as you said, one button, great, but you sometimes need to set settings, tell the scanner to take a scan. Um, one of the things we have done, we've taken our registration technologies off the, the desktop, and we've brought it into the iPad Pro. So you'll be able to register live while you're pulling data off the scanner device. And what's more, all those measurement tools, all those annotation tools, you can do all of that live with the data. So now your, scap your real data capture data is a lot more richer as you begin to collaborate. And again, I, I can't emphasize enough the sharing and collaboration. Because it's wireless and online, you know, if you're online, your data gets synced pretty much almost real time with everyone else, all your project stakeholders. Again, the value of getting this data from the field to wherever your project collaborators are is key in identifying those problems ahead of time. So whether it's the desktop, the web, or other iPads out there, you can be interacting with that data as it's being captured. And let us not forget what makes this all extremely powerful, and that is taking all this really rich reality capture data, bringing it in, and leveraging the power of the Autodesk design software portfolio. Uh, so with that, I thought we'd have a little fun here and sort of uh, think up a few possibilities that you really, we can really truly leverage with this device. So if you can indulge me for a minute, Burkhardt, let's think of a few ideas of, of ways you can sort of think of new ways of working with the device. So let me start. First off, I mean, it's extremely portable. I mean, pack it in a bag, get to wherever you need to go. Basically, nobody even know you even have a scanner with you. That's excellent. What about this one? Boost in efficiency. Detection and resolution of issues will be faster than ever before. Nah, that's not bad. It's not bad. I, I think I got one. I think I got one. Okay, okay. Go ahead. How about a scan a day will keep the change orders away? <laughs> that's great. Okay. That's great, and okay. it's possible. Yeah. What about this one? Thinking about cloud, collaborate from wherever you are. Be in the loop always. Uh, you've touched me there, I gotta admit. Um, okay, you know what, we could do this all night, but you know, let's come together. I mean, we've done something spectacular here. I think um, you know, we're gonna help people work in ways they'd never imagined to be possible. So Excellent. how about that? With this, we invite you to work with us to shape the future of reality capture. And, you know, have a great AU. Please come to our booth and see us. And thank, thank you, you very, very much. much.